Me and your missus, lit up like Christmas. Shouts to Manny Fresh. <laughs> Benny here, GhostBixATS.com, the number one sports consultant in the business. Friday, December 20th, bling, bling, mofo. Day seven, 12 days of Christmas, slot machine day. The slots are hot. The sevens just came in. Ching, 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 ching. Anyway, $7.77 for the entire day. It's all sevens. Day seven, $7.77. All plays. Let's get it. Lots of action this weekend. I finally got a necklace that is actually working and it has some other cool features. You know what I'm saying? We don't just got one action. We blinging, baby. We bling. We got the fast action blinking. We got the uh, slow action blinking. So I'm ready to rock, all right? Three plays today. Two in the NBA. NBA remains good. One college football. I actually have a fourth play in action right now in college football. Let's get this money. Free play win yesterday in the NBA. We're going to get another one today in the NBA. Let's see if we can't get a good free play run going. I didn't have a good day yesterday, really, at all. Yep, no, nope, uh, ugly, bad. So, free play win on the Clippers. Rockets over. We saw uh, that fight in the Rockets that I was talking about, right? They were down. They went into the locker room at half down after getting outscored 41-27 to 27 in the second. I was a little worried about the over at that point, thinking the game was... The only way the game was going to lose is if it becomes a one-sided, lopsided game. But that did not happen. Rockets fought back, snagged the win in L.A., and they now have two wins on the Clippers, which is exciting, you know, giving each other a run for their money. We cash in on the over on the free play. As long as that game stayed close, we were getting over that 233 points. No problem, Bob. That was also a four-unit uh, win on my card. There was another juicy matchup yesterday. The Bucks lakers I came out on the wrong side of that one. I did take Los Angeles plus the points. I actually had a little small little personal bet, sprinkled a tiny bit of money on the money line as well. That was just a little personal bet for me, you know, but uh, I'm a LeBron guy. Did I ever tell you guys that I'm a LeBron guy? You guys know that? Well, I'm a, I'm a LeBron guy. I'm a big, Le big fan of LeBron. I think he's the best. I'm also a Greek freak fan too. I, mean, I was watching him do that Cobra. Have you guys seen that? The uh, Giannis's finishing move for wrestling where he has the Cobra and he Ah, strikes Brooke Lopez and then bam down on the ground so uh anyway I did like the Lakers to cover yesterday the line kept getting smaller and smaller plus five to plus four and a half which is where I took it but it dropped a whole other point after that uh, I think when uh, Anthony Davis was uh, uh announced that he was going to play which made me feel good till I saw the Bucks out there stomping the Lakers they got crushed first half the Lakers come back, win the second half, just wasn't enough. Basketball is certainly a game of runs, right? Bucks end up winning 111 to 104. We lose the cover. That was uh, an NBA top tier bummer loss, man. I was very confident in that play, for real. But today is all plays today. $7.77. I have two NBA, one college football, new no college basketball today. College basketball was an atrocious mess yesterday. I told you, college basketball has been crazy. I have more work to plug into college basketball for sure. As a matter of fact, I have two guys, uh, two partners from my team diving heavily into it because it's been nuts. It has been nuts for me. Last year was, you know, very much the same in college basketball. There was some inconsistency. Then we really zoned in on it and then we really pounded it. March will be here before you know it. I was honestly right around 12 days of Christmas where I started to pick up steam and then January 1st of 2019, zoom, out the gate. Never look back. 365 days is a long time, but 2019 has been overall very good for us. It's been the year of Benny, without a doubt, as a matter of fact. I would you know, very much like to finish this year strong because my last quarter of the year has been crappy in my opinion. By my own standards, I'm not cool with my performance, right? And I want a strong finish. I have a lot of satisfied long-term folk who have been with me all year, but these past you know, few months, golly, up and down and up and down. Anyway, shut up, Benny, I'm rambling. Uh, dropped Maryland yesterday and dropped Arkansas Little Rock. They were my two plays in college uh, basketball yesterday. No college basketball tonight. I'm gonna be back at it tomorrow. I will ride the NBA. I will continue to ride the NBA. I will play some college football today. Let's get a free play. We're going to get it right now, and we're going NBA. We're sticking with what works. If it ain't broke, 
don't fix it. If it's putting money in our pockets, let it put money in our pockets. 10.35 p.m. Eastern time, going late game again. Warriors are taking on the Pelicans out in the Bay. You know, free play of the day will be the New Orleans Pelicans on the money line. Just win the game outright. They're currently minus one and a half. Obviously, the Warriors have the home court advantage at the Oracle. Two teams with very bad records here. Pelicans are 14th in the West. They are right at the bottom of the league. There's only one team worse than the Pelicans in the West. It's the Warriors, right? Pelicans are 7-22. and 22. Warriors are 5-24. and 24. Good for last place. So what are we working with here then, right? We have an injury-plagued, depleted Warriors roster with absolutely zero depth and who cannot play defense. Draymond Green is that guy on the Warriors trying to hold it together. He's that one veteran presence. He can't do it. He's been struggling all year, all season long. His numbers are way down. D'Angelo Russell had been hurt. No Curry, no Clay, no Kevin Durant. These were all guys from last season. First to worst in a hurry, you know? So... Uh, they do have D'Angelo Russell back on the court, which is a big plus, but it's not enough. No depth. Warriors are 1-4 and four against the spread their last five. Both of these teams are not doing too well covering spreads. And I talked somewhat about that awful Warriors defense. But somehow, the Pelicans have managed to be worse on defense than the Warriors. But I th the thing I like for the Pelicans here is that they at least have a few things going for them. They have the young rising stars. Brandon Ingram, hello. All right, they have Zion to look forward to in the future, but uh, we're talking right now. Lonzo Ball, J.J. Redick. I'm not going to lie. I wish J.J. was still in Philly. Uh, we got the old head Drew Holiday out there balling. I think he's going to have a good game tonight. Pelicans can grab wins. They just beat the T-Wolves the other night to snap their losing streak. I think they get the win here tonight as well. Brandon Ingram is key. He is a baller. And Drew Holiday is key tonight. We're going to get that win tonight. Free play of the day will be the New Orleans Pelicans on the money line. It is slot machine day, day seven. It's all sevens. The sevens are lining up. Ching, ching, ching. You go over to the website, www.ghostpicksats, and it's going to pop up, 777. $7.77 for all the plays today. That's Derek, Jack, Bryce, Jimmy, Ben Dog blinging out like a mofo, baby. Let's get it. Good luck. God bless. Grind on, baby. Cheers.